something like this. Sit, sit on your butt and having the poof. You understand? Your contact needs to be when one of the feet is in the air. Yes. Okay, let's do 20. Next mistake in the neck. 20. 1, 2, 3, 4. on a practice session when that's the only thing you need to think about. What will happen in a match where you have all these emotions of uh, fear, anxiety, will to win, maybe the, the line empire is bad, the, 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 the shitty court on futures, what did you say last week, there were no lights on court. Then you're not going to think about uh, missing, you're not going to be aware that you missed. But here, it's, it's forbidden to do it. It's, you should be really hard on yourself if this happens again. Would you focus when you, when you toss the ball? You go, you go like this or you go... Or I, go I go more than other players from here. From side. From side, because I don't have this natural, mm. you know, hip. So if I don't toss like this, I was tossing before like this, but I toss and I end up being like this. Completely open. You don't need to think about anything else apart from hitting the ball. Just hit the ball and everything's going to be okay if you toss the ball like this. No matter what I do, I program my mind the only important thing is to hit the ball in the highest possible position. In an angle, from up, and from up, and go here. Worst guy for me, which I can play, is Fedor. Because his every toss, first, second, kick, wide, body, whatever, is completely the same. And on top, you do whatever you want. And imagine you with left, you're gonna end up making winners of serves which are going to be three CT serves and the next serve is going to be ace Y if you serve it like that. The guy is already going to go on the other side because he's going to start guessing and when they start guessing, that's 20% of your advantage. But you need to have the same toss. Yeah. 